another episode of anything but ASIC. And uh, come, come, come with me. Come follow me on journey. Well, before that, is it time to buy Turtle Coin yet? Just wondering, is it time to buy Turtle Coin? Uh, I've been looking at the yearly chart. Well, I've already shown this before in the previous video, but it's just been going down, 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 down. And it's at a low rate. It's at lower than what it was, I guess, at the beginning of last year, February of last year. Yeah, it's it's way low. So, Turtle Coin, if you don't know, is moving to proof of stake and becoming making some new protocol is supposedly super efficient, super uh, private, whatever, blah blah blah. But maybe, maybe it might make it back as a meme coin, and that's kind of what I'm counting on. But hey, this year, end of this year, whenever they get it done, this might turn out to be the year of the turtle instead of the doge. <sighs> but uh, it's just LARP. It's LARP. Maybe, maybe not. Okay, so here's the journey. Here's the journey. Come with me on the journey. I was going through Dero's uh, Reddit post, and Dero, being the chad of a privacy currency, it is. And um, with with supposed smart contracts, apparently has smart contracts as well. Um, I ran across something. I ran across something um, with smart contracts, and that was Astro BTW benchmark site has a fresh new coin pay. So looked through, went through Twitter, whatever, all that, and I ended up at the benchmarks. Now knowing what it is, RandomX was set up so that. Basically, you could make ASICs to mine this cryptocurrency. Now, I was under the impression that this was a CPU-based type crypto uh, cryptocurrency proof of work. But if you look through this, you start to see. Let's see, move it. You start to see uh, some, and the thirty-nine fifty is not doing all that great. Now you start to see. Some GPUs. Where do you go? I'm not lying. So you see the NVIDIA RTX 3090 FE, and it's doing 6,700 uh, hashes. Which, if we go to, ah, here we go. Minor rocks. You go to minor rocks. You go to minor rocks. Zero. And. Was it 67,000 hashes would come out to 6.7 kilo hashes. Now, that's really not what, not a lot. That's well, actually, that is a lot. <laughs> this is a dollar and 41 cents a day. It better be for what the price of that GPU is in the thousands. But as far as how much dearer you get, that's not much. It's not really much. But then again, there's not really that much dearer to go around, anyways. So, in that respect, it's really winning if you have a uh, RTX 3090. Now, I've been missing, I, I brought this up because I've been misinforming people, especially about RandomX, that at least for the Monero one, Monero versions of RandomX, it's CPU geared towards CPU only. Whereas Astro BT seems to be fair game on the GPU side. Now, what, what I'm really here for is, as I'm looking through these, it's weird that 1070 Ti is actually doing great. I need to find things. While I'm looking through these, I found something. I found something that completely even blew that out the water. Wow, a G-Force is doing well. Raspberry Pi 4 is not really making you anything. Don't even bother unless you just want to support the uh, support the network. It doesn't look like it needs very much support. Let's see. What page was it? Da 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 da. da. Stop dragging. Wait, wait, go back. 
5700G with Radeon graphics. <laughs> See, even the Threadripper's not really doing all that great. <laughs> Somebody used a Tesla GPU on here at a K80. <laughs> At fifty nine fifty, that's that's low. I mean, I, I I guess that's better than. Actually, that's less than the three nine fifty. Well, I, what what's going on here? Let's see. Wait. Raspberry Pi four. Okay, so here's what it came down to: the Neoverse N one twelve core shared, thirty gigabytes. Wait, what? It's supposed to be doing better than that. Anyways, um. Where do you go? Okay, so Neoverse. The Neoverse just came and destroyed everything. The N1 512 gig, 512 gigabytes of memory. It just came and destroyed everything on this list for the most part. And you might be asking, why am I so excited about this? What is the Neo? Inverse in one. Well, apparently it came out in 2019 and it's a server grade ARM chip, which I did not know anybody made. And this thing is a monster. It is a monster in so many regards. And it was tested as a RISC V architecture first on an FPGA. And then pushed to an actual chip and there are a few of them there in the wild now what would you profit off of that on the benchmark was at 6300 so that's six what was that 6.3 6.3 hash it was uh, $1.32 11 0 0 0.110 a day now you're thinking that coming out of a two-core ARM chip, you think that would be possible. Otherwise, you know, Raspberry Pi would be doing something great, but something there has proven that in order to get good hash weights, rates in zero, apparently the what you need is, where did it say it? I just said it. The memory, the memory has to be high. 512 gigabytes. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I'm assuming this was on like um, a instance on like AWS or Azure. But for what this is, it's just crazy. It's crazy. Oh, there it is again. Pulling 9,000 this time. 9,670, which is 9.670. That's two dollars a day. <laughs> oh god! <laughs> if you set it up right, it's two dollars a day. Now this seems great and all that. There's this new secret weapon for beating down even things like 3090 GPUs on the Dero benchmarks but here's where the thing comes apart in order to get one of these you're not just gonna come in as a customer you have to apply for it. you have to register and they come in at literally 10,000 USD excluding taxes so <laughs> the chances of you getting one of these slim but the chances of someone going to spend up an instance on AWS are uh, Azure to outmine people and get that return very high. So, just hope you guys are aware that this thing does exist in the wild and people have been, you know, just messing with it to see what it does. And the results are looking really good. So, let me guys know would you ever pay to actually use this just to see the expressions on other people's faces as the hash rate just gets destroyed? And let me know down in the comments. I'll see you guys soon.